Hey, what's going on, Sunday? What's going on, Sunday? Facebook Sundays. Hey, I got a real quick video. Five things you can do to ensure you lose weight this week. Now, listen, don't even bother listening. <laughs> listen, don't bother listening if you don't need to lose any weight. If you're in a great spot, awesome. Have a killer week. Go enjoy the rest of your Sunday. You're all set, ready to go. Congratulations. Keep moving on. Keep scrolling through. But if you're struggling to lose weight, I'm going to give you five things to do right now. You can do today to ensure you lose weight in the coming week and holiday season, right? So not only do we want to try to keep the holiday weight off, if you're trying to lose weight, I'm going to give you five things right now. Number one, number one, most important thing you can do going into your week and you can start today is to say you can. Number one, make sure you lose weight. Say you can lose weight. In fact, I want you to say it right now. If there's nobody around, you're in your own car here, <laughs> say, I can lose weight. Mark, you're right. I can lose weight. In fact, I've probably done it before. You might have done it before. So you can say, Mark, I have lost weight before and I want to lose weight again, but this time I want to keep it off. So number one, say you can lose weight. And I guarantee if you say it to yourself, you can lose weight. Be positive about it. Go into the week. Say, I can lose weight and you will lose weight. That's number one. Number two, make a plan. You can say you can lose weight and you can say it all you want, but if you don't make a plan, guess what? Chance are it's gonna be harder. Doesn't mean you still can't lose weight. But number two, most important thing to help you lose weight is to make a plan. Now, if you've been making your own plans and you continue to struggle, maybe it's time to get some help. But I'm not gonna talk about that right now. I'm just going to let you know the second thing out of the five things is to make a plan. Failure to plan, planning to fail, right? You've already heard that a number of times in the past. If you're not making a plan now, if you don't have a plan going into the week, chances are it's gonna be very hard for you to lose weight. Number two is make a plan. Number three, you can make a plan and you can have a great plan and you can even say you can. I sound like a Dr. Seuss book, right? But number three, believe in the plan. Well, how are you going to believe in a plan if you are just making it up as you go? Or maybe you got it off the internet. Like, how do you know that it's true? Well, of course, believing in the plan is seeing that same type of plan work for other people, right? If it's a weight loss plan, to see it work for other people. Now, don't be caught into some of those lies you see on on business and advertising and things, right? Like just kind of scamming you out of problems. I hate that. There's nothing worse. And I've been in this industry long enough. Nothing worse than seeing people try to scam you out of your hard-earned money um, and getting you to believe a plan that doesn't really work. Well, again, do some research. Say you can, number one. Number two, make a plan. And number three, believe in the plan. You got to believe in your plan and believe it in yourself that you can achieve that. Number four, join a clan. Now, join a clan. It sounds like uh, <laughs> like are you like some sort of a tribe. Yes, join a clan. In other words, get some support, get help, find yourself a group, hire yourself a coach, get around people who are going to be supportive. It can be your family members, your friends, your neighbors, but get yourself around people who are going to lift you up or going to encourage you. Here's my clan. Now, my business, I have a fitness posse, if you will, a fitness clan, but also have a business clan right there, Seven Figure Mastermind. And I have a clan of people that help me, not only help me understand the plan, they help me say I can, they help me make that plan, and they help me believe in the plan because I'm seeing it working with other people who are a little further ahead than me. That's number four, join a clan. Number five, number five, avoid the spam. Avoid the spam. The fifth thing that you can do to ensure you lose weight this week is avoid the spam, right? <laughs> you can avoid eating spam. I don't think I, I've had fried bologna, but I've never had spam. I don't, I don't think I, ha I might have had spam when I was a kid in my grandfather's. But avoiding the spam, yes. Avoid the, the foods that maybe are going to make it hard for you to lose weight. But more importantly, think of spam like in your mail, in your email. You get the spam. It's like stuff that you don't want to waste your time with, right? Energy, that is things that are going to take up time. Spam, put it in your spam folder. Avoid the spam. Avoid the negative. Avoid the news if you need to. Avoid the people that are going to bring you down, try to pull you down. Avoid the spam at all costs. Those are the five things that's all you need to ensure you lose weight this week. Say you can, make a plan, believe in the plan, join a clan, and avoid the spam. That's it. Take care. God bless. Happy Sunday. Talk soon.